Hello everyone, welcome to another Go High Level video tutorial. In this video tutorial, I will show you how to change the default sign up email for membership in Go High Level. Now, before we get started, you can get a 30 day free trial with our link down below in the description and let's get started. So first of all, what we need to do is we need to go and switch to a sub account. So um, once we switch to a sub account, we want to change the um, default email. So default email template. So what we want to do is we want to go to marketing emails templates. And from here, as you can see, uh, we have a couple of email templates here. We can just create a new one, create template, uh, blank template here. Uh, we can go with the design editor here. And um, obviously how this is going to look like, it's going to be very simple. So we can start from scratch here. As you can see, we have here, we can drop the content. So first of all, you can add your uh, image, which will be kind of like your logo here. So you can just add your logo here. Um, obviously that can be like one thing. We can go here and we can edit the image. We can create using AI or upload using media library. We have this banner image. So I'll just put this banner image for now. Let's pretend this is our logo. So once we have this, we can go and we can add a text here. So under it is going to be a text like, thank you for subscribing to our email. And uh, here, what you can do is you can actually enter. So if we go here, we can enter like username, for example, username. And then what we can do is we can add here, not a link, but what we can do is we can add, this is basically a custom value. So we have here and we need to go to the membership contacts and this is called a login URL. So we have login URL and we actually need to go back. So what we need to do is we need to find username and we need to find password and we need to add them right here. So basically what that's going to be is that's going to be again, go here, custom values. We go to the membership contacts and we go to the email and then we go down below and we have password. And here we want to add a custom value, which will be again, membership contacts, password, right? And obviously under here, you can also, you know, enter something else. You can customize this however you want, right? The point is that we want to save this template and we want to design this template uh, the best way we can. Now, once we design this, we can obviously go and save this template. Um, now this template has been saved. We can go back here. Um, obviously what we want is we want to also rename this template. So let's just go here and we actually have to click on it to rename it. So um, basically we want to click here and you want to go here and just say, uh, default sign up template changed. You can put like that changed. Hit enter, go back. And what we want to do is we want to go to the sites. We have sites and then not sites, but memberships because we have memberships right now. And inside of the memberships, we actually want to change the default, um, the default way or change the default sign up email for memberships. So basically we want to go to sites and once we reach sites, we actually want to go under the membership. So go to the memberships, go to the courses and you have settings here from settings, go to the email settings. And as you can see here, you have welcome email. You can actually go and make sure that this is a new template. It's not yet updated. The name is not yet updated, but you can go here and click new template. So as you can see, this will be our email right here. And we want to hit save here. Uh, one more thing that we want to change in the email is if we go edit here, we can actually edit this uh, inside of this. What we want to do is we want to add a button, which will be a login button here. Um, so obviously this button needs to be under and it needs to be a login button. So basically we just go login and this needs to go straight to your uh, membership URL. That way people can log in here. So you just hit save and that's pretty much it, right? So that's how you can change the default sign up email for membership in go high level. Again, if you have any questions or comments, you can comment down below. And if you want a 30 day free trial, make sure to go down below, click the first link in the description. Thank you guys for watching.